Hi, my name is David Kirkham. I'm the president of Kirkham Motorsports, and welcome to another edition of Kirkham Motorsports University. When we cut the tubes apart, of course the tubes are open. In here on the water jet, we cut out little circles to cap off the tubes. Did the same thing up top, we cut out little squares for the radiator support that had to be cut off to free the nose from the car. This is Jeremy Peterson on the water jet. He's making the piece which is going to go underneath the nose to support the back edge of the nose. We're going to cut this out of a solid piece of 3 8 inch aluminum on the water jet. There's a 3 8 plate of aluminum in there right now. And here we go. Okay, here's the piece that Jeremy made to stiffen up the cowl. I'm going to put it in, see if it fits. The piece we just cut out on the water jet, and look at that. Follows the contour of the body just perfectly. Today we're going to show you how we made the gap between the flip top and the cowl. Right there you can see where we had to trim away some of the body to get the proper gap. And fit it right up against the body shape. We showed you that in an earlier YouTube that we had done this. We got the body shape from digitizing the body. We got the 3 16 gap by taping bolts, 3 16 bolts, to the back of the cowl. There you can see the matching piece that we made for the cowl. And then we just take and drill it. So here Jeremy's going to take, we have holes we made in the mill, and he'll just drill right into the bottom. <laughs> to support the side of the hood, we went to the water jet and cut out these little half circles out of aluminum, and then bolted them to the substructure that we'd welded onto the chassis. To align the hood and support it as it closes, we've made these little channels that we've welded onto the tubes. And the tubes will lay down right into them. And here we'll show you, afterwards we tap the hood side with a blind tap and the cowl is through drilled with a lock nut on the other side. And this is how we'll hold it all together.